MAPS TEMPERATURES IS UNDERWAY WITH RESEARCHERS AT UNMC. It REVEALS THAT CERTAIN AREAS OF OMAHA ARE HOTTER THAN OTHERS. 6 NEWS' BELLA CARACTA TAKES A CLOSER LOOK AT THE FINDINGS AND HOW IT COULD IMPACT YOUR NEIGHBORHOOD. When you check the weather for Omaha each day, it may not be the real temperature that you're experiencing. You may be in what researchers call an urban heat island or pockets of the city that are hotter than others because of things like more pavement and a lack of shade from trees. Two years ago, UNMC deployed heat capturing technology around Omaha, from the Missouri River to around Boys Town. What this project allowed us to do in 2022 was to get hyper local data, micro environment data crossed the Omaha area. There was almost a 10 degree Fahrenheit difference in the temperatures that we were recording at the same time. That's a very big difference to people who have underlying health conditions that can be impacted by heat, who are more vulnerable to the effects of heat. This project allowed us to do in 2022 was to get hyper local data, micro environment data. It was no surprise for researchers at least that the most vulnerable parts of Omaha to heat were the ones that had been historically disenfranchised by the now illegal practice of redlining. Redlining is where banks withheld financial resources to areas with black and brown people. But their study found something else concerning about these areas. Also, those areas that have fewer cooling centers within walking distance of them that have less ability to um, implement some of the mitigation measures like tree canopy because of the way they have been developed. The red dots are those with the highest vulnerability to heat score. All five of them are in North Omaha. The blue dots are the closest cooling centers. And so it's going to just take a little bit more work, more creativity. So these are opportunities where we can work with the city. We can work with um, nonprofit organizations around Omaha. They're working to find and secure funding to cool down the hottest parts of the city by adding trees, sheltered bus stops and cooling centers. On your side, Bella Caracta, 6 News. Researchers with UNMC are also part of the City of Omaha's Climate Action and Resilience Plan Board.